Crews have been working around the clock, but people living in some parts of the area say it's not enough. Their streets are covered in ice and snow. Amy Wattis has been keeping an eye on the road conditions this morning. She joins us live now from Beachview. Amy. Hi, Heather, and we are standing along Broadway Avenue here in Beachview. This is the T line. We saw the T just go past us. As you can see here, if you're looking at the road, this is more of a main road here in Beachview. It is covered. There's a dusting over the road, but this road is pretty well traveled, so it is passable. I've seen several cars going through without a problem. Side streets, though, are a little bit different. Pauline is just off of Broadway. It looks a little bit more covered from where I'm standing. But before we were here in Beachview, we were over on Mount Washington and then over in Greenfield. Greenfield was the worst neighborhood that I saw uh, so far this morning. The, the side streets were, were covered, almost not passable there. So uh, Publix Works crews hopefully will be getting to those sections of uh, the city shortly. And then Mount Washington, Grandview Avenue was... Um, passable, but there were some side streets over there too that were a little tough. Now I know uh, the city crews had been out yesterday afternoon when this snowstorm started and have been out throughout the night and into the morning to make sure you can get to uh, work okay today. I know over the weekend was a different story with the bitter cold temperatures and then the snow and ice mix that we had, which made it difficult to get that ice melted. But now that temperatures are warming up, the city is hopeful that the streets uh, will be okay for drivers today. We believe that some of the material that we've been putting down in those streets is going to finally work. And if we can get to plowing those, we'll do that to help open those up. But, you know, it's been tough the last couple of days with sub-zero temperatures. Nothing is going to melt. All we can do is continue to put material on the streets. Yeah, and it's definitely tough as the snow keeps falling because even though crews are out treating these roadways with the, the salt, it, it is still piling on the roads pretty quickly. So uh, we're going to see this, as Ron mentioned, uh, throughout the day, some snow flurries still falling. Uh, but make sure you're uh, safe. Give yourself some extra time as you head into work this morning and check out the city's snowplow tracker uh, app to see where the snow plows are in your neighborhood. For now, we are live in Beachview. Amy Wattis, KDKA TV Morning News.